The CNE opens in Toronto in just a few days. Come along with CP24 as we check out what's in store this year. One of the first things we got the chance to check out is the new Super Wheel, which is North America's tallest traveling Ferris wheel. The pods are air conditioned, and you have to admit that the view of downtown Toronto is pretty sweet. Right after the Super Wheel, we got the chance to check out the Pink Floyd exhibition, Their Mortal Remains. This is the Toronto premiere of the globally acclaimed exhibition and includes over 350 artifacts from Pink Floyd. After that, we took a quick ride over to the best part, the food. We started off with a slice of deep fried pizza from Pizza Pizza. I just went for the plain one. This one wasn't really for me. I'd maybe give it mm, seven out of 10. Up next was the peanut butter and chocolate corn dog. This is as extravagant as it sounds. The coating is super, super thick. For me, it was maybe even a little too thick, but the flavors were actually pretty good. If you like salty and sweet, this might be one for you. I'd give it maybe a six out of 10. So this is a sweet treat called the Puffs, which is new to the CNE this year. It's 20 fresh mini pancakes loaded with condensed milk drizzle, fruity pebbles, and pineapple. It's very tasty. I'd have given that one maybe an eight out of 10. Before taking any more samples, I got a peek at some other snacks, which include the street corn ice cream, which looked pretty crazy. But this was actually the street corn lemonade. Uh, it had tahine and a little bit of pickle. It's actually pretty refreshing, especially if you like corn. This one I found a little disappointing. It just wasn't for me. These are the street corn ribs, where it's a piece of corn and it's deep fried and has lots of toppings. They're very tasty, but I just found them a little bit chewy. I'd maybe give them a five out of 10. They were okay, but for me, the texture wasn't perfect. Now this next one is a CNE favorite and for good reason. This is just a deep fried Oreo. You can't go wrong with this one. I found this one just a little hard to kind of dig into. They're very chewy, but oh my gosh, it's just fluffy and sweet and so, so tasty. 10 out of 10 out of 10, so, so good. So I was starting to feel a little thirsty at this point. Uh, this is the pineapple lychee habanero tea. Um, this one was super refreshing, but that habanero is pretty strong. If you like spicy things, this one might be for you. I found it a little too spicy, but it was actually pretty tasty as well. Uh, I then moved on over to the deep fried cheese curds with fruity pebbles. This one sounds like a classic weird CNE combination, but I actually thought this one worked pretty well. I might actually buy this when I go back to the CNE this year. I'd give this an eight out of 10. It was pretty good. And moving right along, this was a speculose or biscoff flavored crawfle, which is a cross between a croissant and a waffle. It's a little tricky to eat. I'd maybe suggest eating this one with your hands, which I wound up having to do to get a really good bite. Um, but this one was super, super tasty. That flavor is really subtle and really light. And then the cream just helps to balance it even more. Again, this is one that I might actually buy when I head back to the CNE this summer. And just before we headed out, we found these dragon fruit juice pouches with coconut jelly right at the bottom. Super refreshing, super light and fragrant. Nothing too weird about this one, just very, very tasty. And of course, it's not the CNE without ice cream. So this was a hazelnut Ferrero Rocher milkshake. And if you buy this one at the CNE, it'll actually come with a full piece of cheesecake attached to it. It's so decadent and so, so tasty. Pretty strongly recommended. And before we headed out, we just had to get some ice cream too. So this was a chocolate and vanilla swirl. Normally it'll come in a croissant ice cream cone. Uh, this time they just gave us a piece of the croissant, but both parts of this dessert were super, super tasty. It's, you can't go wrong with ice cream and a croissant, 10 out of 10. The CNE runs this year from August 18th to September 4th. See you there.